What the heck? <laughs> today is February 21st and uh, we're gonna stay in today because my brother is injured. He's got gout. Swollen. Well, he thinks he has gout, but it's not gout, it's something. I think I'm coming down with something. My throat really, really hurts this morning. Left the air on last night, and that's probably why. Also, I went up to the rooftop yesterday, it's super windy. Then Taco Tuesday for my brother. See the love that I do for him, I put out for him. And now I have the consequences of sickness. You should be ashamed of yourself. Shine, shine, shine. Hi, baby girl. So I watched you sing all morning. How so? On YouTube. <laughs> oh. Baby girl, let's put the food down. Say hello to Auntie. Who's that? Say hi first. One more, say hi. Hi, baby girl. So where's Uncle Vin? Uncle Vin? He's over there. He's so lazy. Yes. <laughs> I miss you. I miss you too. Talk to Auntie that you have more. You keep ignoring her. You want to talk to her, but then when you call, you ignore her. It's the silent treatment to get you to like her more. Baby girl, if you don't talk to me, the new baby is going to come. I'm going to love her more. She's going to love baby Evelyn more. You want that? Yeah. Yes. yes. <laughs> okay, fine. Bye, Felicia. Since my brother's in town, I tried to take him out, but he can't go out. He's obviously injured, so I'm going to cook for him. Some blue apron. Yeah. I'm trying to get rid of it. This is the best way to do it. <laughs> Give it to him. Yes, he's a trash disposal. Yeah, that's what I did to my sister's house the other day. <laughs> I ate everything. Livia, are you ready to talk to Auntie? Yeah. No? no? Oh my goodness. I gotta say, she likes you better in person. <laughs> Welcome to the Salt and Pepper Show. <laughs> On today's menu, we have. Strip steak and potato salt and pepper. Ooh, I get to make a selection. Then we have the beef medallions and scallion salsa verde with salt That's and so pepper, good. courtesy of Blue Apron. Ooh. Their special ingredient is salt and yes. pepper. Salt and pepper. They contracted it to me, <laughs> and I have their special <laughs> ingredient, all for you. <laughs> Next, we have the Greek chicken with. Salt and pepper. Ooh. And last but not least, spicy fettuccine and beef blognis with salt and pepper. <laughs> Let's see what we use more, salt or pepper. <laughs> yes, you're gonna eat a lot of sodium today. I don't know if that's good for your gout, but we are staying in today and we're gonna make it happen. So what would you like? Um, let's do this. <laughs> Love it. Spicy fettuccine. Because yes. my brother has gout, he can't be eating meat, red meat. Try to so we have to stay away from that. Just a little bit of tiny ground beef. First step, it says to prepare a large pot of salt and pepper. <laughs> salted water to boiling salted on water. high. <laughs> Let's do that first. Here it is. Special ingredient. <laughs> Salt. Yes. Got my brother helping out, peeling the garlic. Teamwork <laughs> makes the dream work. Today's recovery day for him. Got my pasta going and now I'm going to cook my meat. This is to season. Salt and pepper. Careful, careful. Lots of sodium today. Well, for the last two weeks, actually. But I want to show my brother how much salt I've been eating. <laughs> Says to add chopped garlic, zucchini, and sliced celery. Oh ah! All of this. Add it to the pan. Oh. What's next? Cook, stir for three to four minutes or until lightly soften and <laughs> season with salt and pepper. I could just, I could just not look at this and, and just be like, 
Season everything with salt and pepper. What's the next step? Salt and pepper. <laughs> Why? Oh my goodness. Okay, cook it, cook it, cook it. Got all of my ingredients. I added the tomato sauce, the uh, Italian seasoning. Pasta is ready. Adding my pasta to the sauce. This should be it. Just mix it up and ready to serve. Five star Michelin meal is served. Michelin meal? From salt and pepper. <laughs> yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. So you can add the cheese on top if you want, but I don't know if you should be doing cheese since you have gout. No. But if you don't want cheese, you can have um, some wine. Pepper. <laughs> Red crushed pepper. I don't know about wine. Yeah. I'm sick. I don't know if I should be doing wine. I'll do water. You got the pot right next to you. <laughs> <laughs> you got the bowls that you got one that you have to find. Got some cheese here. Would you like cheese, sir? No, 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 no. <laughs> <Okay>. no. <laughs> Don't ruin a great thing. <laughs> Snap, it. Snap it. Yes. Let's Instagram this. Yes. I'm trying to like do all these platforms. It's so difficult. <laughs> Having pasta for lunch by Blue Apron. For my brother. <laughs> Let me know what you think. It's pretty salty. <laughs> I actually took out some salt. They wanted me to add the water, mm -hmm. the salt water from the uh, noodles. I was like, I don't Add that much salt water. Salty, huh? And you just put water in. Today, basically a chill day. I am sick. My brother is injured and we're watching a movie, Gone with the Wind. It took me forever to convince my brother to watch this movie because I thought it was one of the classic movies that is really entertaining and fun. And he's been sitting there having a ball laughing. These girls are crazy. <laughs> girls are crazy, he said. <laughs> girls are crazy, that's why he's still single and <laughs> not ready to mingle and never wants to get never, married. Never. Never. <laughs> Conniving women. Conniving women. There you go. Never gonna get married. <laughs> Whoever his wife is in the future, just to let you know, he said he never wanted to get married. So if you got married, you swindled him. You swindled him. <laughs> Four hours and the movie Gone with the Wind Pass. And what is your verdict, Vin? It is pretty entertaining. <laughs> <laughs> I like how the end he was like, frankly, I don't give a damn. <laughs> Cause man, she bamboozled him too much. <laughs> like, damn. And then when the girls start chasing you, you're just like, I'm over this. <laughs> <laughs> so you enjoyed it thoroughly. Yeah, it was Horrible. Horrible. Horrible woman. Should we watch Scarlet later? <laughs> <laughs> Continuation to uh, Gone with the Wind. Oh my god, it's such a great movie. <laughs> Maybe we'll grab some dinner first and then <laughs> Scarlet later. <laughs> Today has been a very chill day. Just basically watching movies with my brother. I'm coming down on this sickness for real. I got my water and salt water. Oh, salt again. Yeah. <laughs> Salt again. <clears throat> I need to clean my throat and gargle and kill all that germs in my throat. Oh my god. <clears throat> so I can sing this weekend. Here we go. <clears throat> it's going to be a long movie night tonight. Just chilling, taking it easy, relax, get better. <sighs> Thanks, Vin, for making me watch Pitch Perfect. <laughs> Terrible. I made him watch Gone with the Wind. He made me watch P Pitch Perfect. What a bad trade. <laughs> Terrible trade.